my name is Kevin, and while sipping liquid energy out of a Gojira glass may be great, there's one way that might be more electrifying. By imbibing out of the Pikachu winking pint glass. And if that doesn't cut the mustard, at least you can cut the pizza with the Pokeball pizza cutter. Because this is Game Loot. For those who missed out on the NES Classic Mini, like I did, you can still grab the Mini Famicom, plug in the HDMI cable, and experience the Japanese version of the NES, including games like Donkey Kong, The Legend of Zelda, and Metroid. Wear Metroid bosses on your sleeve by poking your shirt with these custom enamel pins, featuring two versions of Ridley. But don't let no crade rain on your parade, block precipitation while holding the Legend of Zelda Song of Storms umbrella. With that overhead get this Undertale. The collector's edition includes the complete Undertale soundtrack, sheet music, and a music box locket. Unlock the heart of your significant other by offering them this engraved Super Mario ring. But if they're not ready to level up your relationship, don't worry -o. Just break the awkward silence by busting out the Super Mario level up board game. The 3D game board will have you gathering coins in an attempt to reach the castle at the top. Top your head with Hyrule while rocking the Master Sword Cap. Then sit down and take a deep breath of the wild leather jacket, sporting a climbing link liner that'll help you look for every last shrine. Let your living room give off a pixely shine thanks to the 8-bit fireplace. But if you're more into wall art than fireplace art, check out these prints by Fabled Creative. your own art on Geralt style after pre-ordering the Witcher adult coloring book. Now lace up your Air Jordan Super Nintendo NBA Jam Edition sneakers if you missed out on the Jordan NES 4, because we're about to slam dunk some plushies. First up is Cloud from Final Fantasy 7 showing no strife brandishing his buster sword, but beware because plush Sephiroth is here to destroy the planet. For those looking to squish Horizon Zero Dawn, the Aloy plush will comfortably sit on your Horizon Zero desk. And if that's not enough squeeze, say hello to the brand new line of Slime Rancher plushies. Pre-order Pink, Tabby, Honey, or the whole three slime stack. Don't spiral forever into a plush pile, spy row into this exclusive awesome statue. First four figures have lovingly recreated Spyro the Dragon, including the base from the original game's cover. The figure also features animated LEDs and comes with five gems in a decorative box. While we're waxing nostalgic for classic platformers, run right into the 25th anniversary Sonic the Hedgehog art book. Officially licensed and made in conjunction with Sega, it contains key art, rare material, and a complete written history of the origins and evolution of designing the blue blur. To spin the sweet sounds of the latest Sonic, there's the Sonic Mania soundtrack on vinyl. Or simply feed your eyeballs with the wondrous Nicolas Cageamon paintings. Collect Cageachu, Cageasaur, Snora Cage. Ah, uh, you know what? Just go ahead and cage them all. Okay, so what am I playing now? Well, I finished Neo, which was amazing. It's probably my second favorite PS4 game to date. Not to date, like, go out on a date with. To date, as in, like, time. Number one being Bloodborne. So after Neo, I played through Cave Story on the Switch, which looks so good on the Switch. I really recommend this game. It's super charming. It's quick. You can play through it in a few days. Really, you could probably play through it in one sitting if you knew exactly what you were doing. But anyway, check out Cave Story. It's an action adventure shooting game thing a la Metroid, sort of. But anyway, this game rocks. Also, I recently picked up this. Okay, so this is the remarkably tiny PS1 that comes with the flip up screen. Sony always puts out a slim version of their console kind of towards the end of its lifespan. And I think this is definitely the coolest one. And you can see how much smaller it is than the original model. So yeah. All right, so let me know if you've played Cave Story. Let me know if you have the PS1 with the screen. And if not, just let everyone know what you're playing right now. Also, check out my new video over on Vsauce 2, The Invention of blue. And as always, thanks for watching.